Alright everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some Lee Sin in the mid lane running Harvest, Sudden Impact, Eyeball, Ultimate Hunter, Triumph, and Tenacity. We're gonna do Lethality slash AD Lee Sin. I'm just gonna go max damage because Lee Sin can turn into an assassin basically when you have full AD. He hits very hard. His Q has an execute, hits twice, his kick does a lot of damage, 200% bonus. See, we're against Akali. Normally, I hate playing against Akalis, but I think Lee Sin might actually be pretty good in this matchup because my abilities reveal her. So if she goes invisible and I press E and hit her with that, it should work. Ooh, she's got bone plating. Except early, I feel like she's just going to out-trade me pretty hard unless I catch her in an all-in. Because her Q outranges my E. But I think my level 2 is stronger. It's just she's going to hit two first. So I'll play safe. Also have a poppy jungle. She'll stop a Kali from dashing. Yeah, nobody ever plays Lee Sin in lane anymore. He's actually not that bad of a laner. But everyone just plays in jungle. Oh, I destroyed her health bar. Triumph? Nice. We got her. Akali down. Thought I wasn't going to get in range for that auto attack. But basically, the only things you need to know for Lee Sin is every time you use an ability, he gets two faster auto attacks. And every single one of his abilities can be used twice. In the... The Q2 does more damage the lower they are. So what you can do is hit the Q, do a bunch of damage to him, and then take the Q since it's an execute based on missing health. I mean, I kind of want to do like a Ravenous Hydra so I have some healing. I think that would be a good first item. I'm just going to grab a pickaxe. I didn't even use my potion in that fight too. And at level 6, Lee Sin has some real good burst. Not the greatest versus tanks, though, but versus squishies, I'm going to delete them. If I went Eclipse route, I'd do some damage versus tanks. They actually don't even have a... They only have one tank. It's just Darius. I actually got that minion. We have a Zyra jungle. She did just get buffed for jungle. But I'm going to, like, one-shot all of them except for Darius. Oh, nice. The pickaxe allows me to one-shot minions. We can ward hop in and engage also. But if I want to sit back and farm safe, I can just use my abilities. If I farm with the edge of my E on a minion, I should be out of range of her Q. I use my Q. That goes even further. Oh, she wants to fight. Ooh, Poppy got a really nice... Uh... Oh, I guess it doesn't reveal her. That's lame. Maybe it didn't hit her, but I'm pretty sure that did. I think my Q reveals her if I hit that. It says reveals, but I guess... They had to make assassins like Akali even more broken. Ah, nice. The Q reveals her, at least. I can get her. Oh, almost. Lee Sin's in the jungle max their W second. I might max my E for the damage. I think if I hit a Q on her at that health, it kills her. Especially if I have Ignite. I can still use this ward that's here. Oh, that was a close one. I don't know where Zyra is. Yeah, I have enough damage with my Q. Just two Qs kills her. Oh, 
I'll just kick her and ignite. <laughs> I might be able to beat her. Let's see, she might not know that I'm chasing still. Nope, she went into her jungle. Nice. It didn't go how I planned, but at least I got... Oh no. My cannon. At least I got a Kali. Kind of figured Zyra was going to gank with how she was playing. Hmm, we got a base. I can E and get all three of these minions. Two of them. Okay. I got a base. This is a very strong Versicali, actually. This is working well. And then... Once I have Hydra, I just heal. And Leeson has built-in Omni Vamp, Lifesteal, and Spell Vamp with his W, too. Yeah, we haven't played Lee Sin on the channel in forever. I like playing him. He's a pretty hard champion. The Poppy's behind her. He's not going anywhere. I had to take my Q before she uh, went over the wall or else I wouldn't be in range. Oh, nice. I got the assist. And I have wave clear with uh, Ravenous. I have really good wave clear. So use an ability, auto twice, use an ability, auto twice. And we melt turrets this way. Cleared the wave while hitting the turret. I mean, 50 on the shield and... Oh, wait, this is way better. As much as I want the E, having 5% more healing and 50 more on the shield is going to be way better for fighting people. What is our Rakan doing up here? She's gone. <laughs> I was gonna flash kick her into Rakan, but I th didn't want to die there. And luckily, I was able to get the auto after hitting. I think you can always get an auto attack in while you're kicking him away. I can't. She's gonna try and kill me. We have a Ravenous. If I can get a hundred more gold, though, I can get boots, and I kind of want boots. She's on a mana. Uh oh. The Darius triple. Oh, he's kind of low. Oh no, she hit me midair. Keep punching. I'll ignite. Oh, I could have shielded myself. I could have probably lived. Zyra might have killed me. I think Zyra's right here. Oh, Lilia didn't hit out her ring. She should just be able to walk away, but I don't think she will. That is not a good spot to recall. But it worked. Okay, for Mythic, we can do Eclipse or we could do Duskblade. I think I'm going to do Duskblade. Or we could do Ghostblade. I don't want to do Eclipse because I don't need the armor pen. They're not going to build armor. So the haste is nice. But also if you have too much haste on Lee Sin, you run out of energy too fast. And then I might mess up. But I don't really want to go Ghost Blade. So, Dusk it is. My Dusk will be nice because I can assassinate somebody, kill him, and then peel. Get myself out of there. Look at that wave clear now. Yeah, I can actually hold on to my wards on this champ because I can just ward hop over the wall. <laughs> That damage is crazy. Oh, I don't have energy. 
You can get energy back by auto attacking. Let's see, I'll W twice. I do have a lot of healing, actually. Yeah, your passive autos give you 15 energy. I think it scales more, too. She's dead if that hits. If you're really good with Lee Sin, there's a lot of like super fast combos you can do. Like ward hop in, kick him, Q. But I don't play him that much. I just know the basics. Look at that damage. Lee Sin destroys squishies. I should be able to heal the full off this wave. Nice, they got Darius. Now there is one downside of Lee Sin. He, uh, oh, that hits her bone plating from really far away. He falls off. She's so low. Oh. He falls off pretty hard late, but he's so strong early that if you go full AD, you can stay strong for long. But late game, you turn into a kick bot if you're not full damage. You just have to kick and position them. What boots do I want? I already have tenacity in my runes. Do I need more? I mean, they're pretty heavy magic damage team, but armor boots might help me first towers and stuff too. I'm just gonna go armor boots. Because Darius is fed and Kogma has two kills. So we'll do Duskblade. I could do Axie Mark and have more kicks, but the cooldown's not that long. How about a Prowler's Claw? Crawler's Claw Edge of Night would be good. Cleaver's pretty good on him, too. I like the Ravenous first. That was a good idea. There's a Zyra plant here. Let's see. Never again will arrogance lead me astray. You could be waiting on the sides. The thing is, I can 1v2 them. As long as I don't miss my Q. I should just roam. My training Who do I still need? I just need bot lane since I got Darius. Oh, I must be really far ahead. Oh, there's a seed here. I'm flashing just in case I get hit by that root. Oh my god, I kicked Kogma at like 30% HP and it killed him. How much does that do? 754? Oh my god, that hurts. I will master the dragon spirit. Okay, I do way too much damage. This is probably going to be a double game, because I'm going to be able to carry. I knew this was strong, but I didn't think I would be just deleting him this quick. If I go Edge of Night, then I'm, like, really hard to kill, because I get health and a spell shield. I'm actually really squishy, so if they do catch me, I can die. I want to do a flash kick this game. So we could try that. Since I'm super far ahead, I can try combos I won't normally do if I'm trying to actually not throw. I love this wave clear, actually. This is such a good item on him. Darius. I should be able to burst Darius. He has no armor. Maybe we ward hop in with W. Kick him and then land Q, but if he's in minions, I won't be able to land that. Nice. 
I think if I ward hop, though, I don't get a shield. Oh my god, even Ash is beating Akali. Usually, even if Akali doesn't have anything, she can still one-shot ADCs. More lethality. Let's do... I want to do the Prowlers, because I do land auto attacks. That would add a lot of damage. We have a lot of dashes. I think I'll do Prowlers, then probably Edge of Night. Is no prowlers, Edge of Night. Last item, we could do Grudge to slow him on the Qs. Or we could do, like... I don't know. I already have a slow on my E. But having a slow on Q would be cool, too. But a, a cleaver or something might be better. Or like a shojin. I don't know. Arius is coming. I can assassinate somebody though if they don't have a ward. Oh boy. I actually don't want to go in on him since he's full stacked. I don't have a ward. I don't have a ward. I need to buy pink, actually, to jump to. That's what I should have done. There's going to be a Zyra somewhere over here. I don't think that revealed... Oh my god, I do so much damage. That's half of Darius's health with just Q and E. Let's try and kill Kog'Maw. Q kick Q is going to do the most damage for like bursting somebody like that. Because you hit the first Q, so then you have another Q to jump to them. But then you kick them to get their health low. And then you take the second Q, which uh, is an execute. So it's just so much damage. <laughs> well, if I hold the Q, I keep her revealed in her shroud. I guess that's good enough. I forgot how much I enjoyed playing this guy, and I'm not even good with him. I just know the basics. But I determine my own fate. You guys should watch Heisman play Lisa, and he does some crazy kicks and stuff. Ooh, blue buff's actually good on... On needle region, my energy. Master yourself. Master. Yeah, I'm definitely going to go Edge of Night next. I'd like... Oh, actually, I'm not worth building on 40... 40 second ult. Is that the red I cleared a while ago? Could be on a ward. Uh, I should have bought a pink again. I might as well go buy one. They're, they're sitting under tower. I'll buy two. How about that? This is the most pinks I've bought all month. I mean, as soon as we're not able to one-shot them anymore, we fall off. The good thing is, we're going to be able to one-shot them all. Darius is the only one that's going to be tanky, and he doesn't have armor yet. My Q one shots the caster minions. Oh, I missed them all. I really want to go in this, but I really don't want to give him a thousand gold. She dodged the Ash Arrow. I was gonna try and give Ash that kill. Ash is getting destroyed. Two plants are killing Ash. 
That actually didn't do that much damage to Ash. Like, if she's going to tank 100 plan autos, she'd probably die. If this Ira had two items. I'm in the wall. I can't Q these, because look what happens. Guess that's the downside of AD Lee Sin. Because if you're your regular tanky Lee Sin, I don't think you one shot those and you can use them to jump around. I think the only way I'm gonna die is if I get Braum CC'd. I think they have a ward here. Poor Zyra is gonna walk into this. Although there's no reason for her to go topside if jungle's not up. I will atone. I don't know where Darius is going. He's gonna come behind us or something. Come here. I didn't even get to kick her. I ignited him. Oh, they have to Okay. Gimme. Yes, I killed both of them. Alright, we're gonna play this again. We're gonna have game two, Lee Sin. This is strong. It's strong and fun. Let's see how much damage I did. That was like a really good comp for me to play that into. I normally don't like Akali's, but this is an exception. This works. 29k damage, rune stance on a game two. All right, we got game two for you guys. This one's probably going to be harder because Vex can counter my Q, I think. And they got three tanks. So I, I'm probably going to do the Eclipse for this one. I'm still going to go the Ravenous Hydra first, but I'll go Eclipse second. And then I might even go the Grudge third for more armor pen. Or Cleaver. Because tanks we can't really one-shot unless I get uh, pretty far ahead. Yeah, okay, Vex is going to be annoying until we're level 3. I mean, at least I have multiple ways to jump in. I can jump in with my W and I can jump in with Q. I don't want her to fear me out of Q because then I won't deal any damage with it. Today will be a worthy test. I hit her. Okay. I'm not gonna jump in too many minions. I'll just walk up to her. Darn, there's minions in the way. Let's gotta chunk her a little bit more and then we can just all in. Poppy's here again. Hey, it worked. The Vex didn't keep running. Another kill I got. First blood under turret. Which is very close, because if I took one more turret shot, I'd be dead. Ah, she has TP. We gotta push quick. She shouldn't be able to freeze this. She can, but she'd lose like quarter of her health. Nice. Alright, let's do the Ravenous. I'd rather go the uh, the pickaxe actually again, even though the lifesteal would be nice for sustaining. If I go to auto attack, that's when Vex pokes me. I me should live. Nice. The dragon must be unleashed, or it will. Yeah, they got a lot. Two tanks with CC. Alawi, I can kind of just ignore if I don't go top. I mean, I do need to kill her for ultimate, but. Oh, 
I might when she burns her her fear. When the bar's red, that means she has the fear up and her next ability will fear. Now the bar does charge up really fast when dashes are used next to her. Ooh, I need this cannon though. I'll let Poppy have it. I got really scared. Oh, wait. This guy's so low. <laughs> I didn't know he was low, actually. But, I mean, I didn't have Q up, so it's not like I could have done anything to him. There's just auto-attacking Vex. Out. May as well help Poppy with this. I like using my W before I take Q. Because it uh the Q does a lot of damage, so they'll give a lot of healing. I don't even think I'll lose that much. This might be a Merc Tread game. It definitely is. I'm gonna go with this. I'll just buy one potion. Red buff will heal me. I don't have to wait all the all the health. Cause this, it doesn't do the area of effect on abilities till the item's complete. And I'm not auto attacking the minions that much using abilities. Scared to E there because it would get all the minions low, but that actually it does so much damage, even at rank one. Whatever. I can kill her. It would be close. I wanted to um Q auto kick then Q. But I couldn't get in range to auto attack her. I think I'm dead. I didn't have a ward to hop to, unfortunately. Oh, I died mid-dash. Yeah, I thought I had a ward to hop to. I did not. Should have bought a pink. My fault. I thought I'd be able to kill Vex before she could kill me, but... I dashed, and I think she got her passive extra damage on me, like, twice there. We just need the Ravenous Hydra. Maybe I'll even go roam. Oh, wow, Elo, she's OP. Go kill this guy. Oh, we can wait at his red. He's gonna come to red. Oh, he saw me. I'll take it. Okay, we can get her. Okay, got her all. And Heimer got her. Nice. Wait, if she dies, it doesn't... And the tentacles after me? I didn't know that. I thought I'd still have to dodge those. Alright. Vex is actually kind of tanky with her shield. And she's building health. I think she's going to go crown. She's either going crown or uh, everfrost. Nautilus is low. If I kill Nautilus, I might die to Lucian, though. Hopefully he doesn't have exhaust. If he has exhaust aftershock, I might not get him. I'm not going in. 
I have another chance, actually. Oh, nice. We got both. Poppy down, though. Who is Predator? Bully Bear. Just Vex is higher level than me because I keep roaming and she's just sitting mid pushing. She's lower CS than me, also. I'll buy a Pinkerton to jump to. An enemy has been slain. Well, I have 5 out of 5 Ultimate Hunter now. Is knowing the value of one They're definitely going Eclipse. I could use the shield. I'm going to need Armor Pen. They're going to stack armor. Hopefully, I can still like one-shot Lucian and Vex, which I should. She's roaming. She's back. Well, I want a ward for Vully Bear. Pretty sure he's here. Oh wow, he's here. Uh oh, is she gonna run it down? That was kind of clean. Darn, she flashed. Otherwise, I would have had her too. Yeah, I since I had Ravenous Hydra, I insta-cleared that wave and they weren't expecting that. And then I kicked her back under turret. She panic altered the other way too. Bully Bear's top, so I'm getting a lot of plating here. Wow, oh, she was too key. Wait a second. She didn't wait for all her health to come back. Tank one more shot for Poppy. Beautiful synergy. Ah, missed the cannon. I have kick to hit away Bully Bear. I should heal the full off next wave. I bloodied my knuckles to sharpen my fists. Oh yeah, that's some good healing. Nice. Bully down. Oh, he's lethality, Bully Bear. That's why he did so much damage there. Let me go by really quick. I think we go Mercs, although Lucian's fed. It's lethality, Bully Bear, though. I'm going armor boots. Man. What did I buy last time? Wait, I'm going Eclipse. I guess the boots can wait. I want lethality. Well, at least Heimer actually counters Alawi, so we shouldn't have to worry about her being strong. Alawi counters melee champs. Alawi can't even reach Heimer, nor hit an E through his turrets. We get plating. There is a bully bear around. Oh, he can't even. Move. Not only is this full HP, I can just wait. See, I Q, kick, then Q again. Nice. I shielded Pike and saved him. There's 
there's a bear here. Oh my god, he dies so fast because he's lethality. I can't believe he didn't go tank. I'm the only one that ever goes lethality bully bear. Now if I had kick, I could kill him. If I land a Q, though, I could also kill him, but I don't want to die. Seven hundred damage kick coming right up. Yeah, if I land Q on Lucian and then kick him and Q him again, that should just one shot him. Oh no, we want Eclipse. Hmm, I don't have enough, so sword. Poppy's here. Oh, over the wall. Oh my god. This is so strong. A really good synergy with a Poppy jungle too. She's even going even shroud to make me deal more damage. We already got that first game, so I don't care if they they F up. If I play stuff like assassins are always very easy for me to win quick on. Because normally I'm playing mages that need to like to scale to two items before they can actually like one shot people. These champions one shot people at like level six. <laughs> oh, you went go Didn't he have a dust blade or something? He's going like move speed. That build actually seems kind of fun though, but not if you're behind. Because you could be really fast and run at him. Maybe I'll do that next Volley Bear build. Uh, we can't really do too much here. Ooh. She gonna fear me if I went in. I wouldn't be able to combo. Oh, Ash can just perma slow. Neat. Oh my god, I have 3,000. 4,000. Got my shutdown. Oh, Lucian got it. Okay, whatever. We're about to win anyway. I mean, how much armor do they have? They actually don't even have much armor. Only Nautilus does. Nautilus and Alawi. Let's do. I 
might do the prowlers. Failure has not stopped me before. It will not now. Let's just try the grudge, because I didn't get to the grudge last game. I will master the dragon spirit. I try. Oh my god, that just kills him. How much does my E do? 300? 370. I mean, we gotta get other... other lanes. I don't know. Oh, we have a herald. Okay, perfect. Alright, GG. If you guys enjoyed the Lee Sin games, please hit the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not. Last but not least, leave a comment below. Check out my website, zwag.gg. Got a lot of cool keyboards. I'm going to be listing, like, a lot of them tonight, I think. If I can get to them, because I got, I got, like, 30 more to add. Everybody who's gotten them so far says they like them, so, yeah. Also got signed mouse pads. All the good stuff, so yeah. I don't take donations anymore on my streams or whatnot, so if you want to just donate, buy a keyboard instead. Then you get something in return that's nice. Let's see the damage on this one. 31k. Here's our rune stats, and I'll see you later. Peace!